Okay, now we are in the self-care. So the first thing is self-care activities and you can customize it. And these is, are going to be shown in the daily planner. Then we have the journaling section. So the journaling section, I can add a new uh, journal entry from here or from the dashboard. Uh, I create a new one and the date is always the current date because this the, the today uh, new entry and I can add gratitude affirmation they win I add something this is how my day went and uh, I have gratitude I am grateful for my family I am strong they win uh, complete some tasks Okay. And the cool things is that we can check the affirmation, the gratitude and the daily win. So each time we add a new uh, entry, okay. Uh, the first is going, you're going to see it here. And the filter is this week, this month, this year or all. Okay. So you can have everything organized. So for example, if you have all, you see that I, there is some old entries and this, all these entry fits this journaling overview where you can see the affirmation that you, that you did, the gratitude that you express and the daily win. Okay. And then you can, uh, have a calendar view of it. These are the journal entry and gratitude affirmation and daily win. Okay, go back. We have a habit building. So basically these are simple habit tracker and is automated. So basically it uses the new recurring template feature in Notion. So basically if you want these, if you want to customize, you need to customize these. Okay, so for example, I'm going to edit this template, edit, and this habit is journaling. And basically the next week, okay, this um, is going to populate this. You only see the current week. So here you can see the, the, the current week, okay. And if you go to archive, you say that you see that there are a ton of weeks because basically it's auto populate, but, uh, but the cool things that you to don't feel overwhelmed from maybe you don't, you don't check, check out, you know, you're not working for some week on your habits. You can just not see them because you can archive them and never see them again. But this is the, uh, habit tracker. Okay. And then you can read some psychology on habit building. Okay and that's for habit building this habit tracker is going to show up is the same that you can find inside the weekly planner okay then we have the fitness tracker it's very simple we have a month page okay and for all the day we can choose our activity okay and when we exercise and then uh, if we can we want to create a new monthly spreadsheet we can by clicking add a new fitness tracker here okay so okay and we can for example archive it the the old one by just moving drag and moving here okay so this another and the feature then we have the therapy journal and the therapy journal is a way to you to take notes on your therapy if you do therapy and the some therapy notes so things that you want to you know take the session and you can get a session summary and this is very very used to you very easy to use uh, you see you have some little uh, summary session 
we go to Sakkar again and medication tracker. So we can have our medication, the date we start, the dose, um, when we take this medication, the time, and there is also some refiller manner that you can add. And these tell you how long did you take this med. So you set up date of start, you see how your how much time, how long do you take this uh, medication. Then you can check your medication tracker by time and also check by image. Okay, you can add the image if you have trouble remembering the, 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 the medication that you take. Okay, next we have the sleep tracker. It's very simple. You add a new sleep day you and you set up when you go to sleep and when you wake up and this will automatically calculate if you have a good sleep, underslept, overslept. Okay, so basically this is based on your hour goal. So if our hour goal is eight, um, you see that we actually sleep for nine days, so we overslept and so on. And then we have connected to it, we can add uh, a dream. So this is the dream journal. And you can uh, add the date, connect to the, the sleep tracker and add your emotion or whatever. And this is all for the self-care.